Maybe I went a little bit too early. I don't know. <clears throat> All right. Try again. I'm in position. Bond, this is Tanner at Q Branch. Hostile radio chatter shows your landing has gone undetected. Blueprints show Greco's quarters are located on the lower deck. Find him and stop the attack on the G20. Come on, there's nothing out there. We just need to wait for Greco's word, then get the job. Stop running into things. Yeah, have some random henchman stop me. You probably don't even know the guy's name. Alright. There we go. <coughs> Alright, boat driving time. This is the only time it happens in the entire game. Poor Greco. Hey, he has he's hired a bunch of useless men for whatever crimes he's trying to commit. <clears throat> guy out. Almost forgot what button that was for. Get out of my way. Didn't have a choice there. I mean, I did, but... Like, literally, I had a choice, but figuratively, I didn't. I know that doesn't make any sense. I don't care. Still have my foot pedal plugged in, I can use that if I don't want to split on the keyboard. M, how much time do we have? Not much. They're assembling the heads of state for the picture. <clears throat> Nice 
this one. That's it, bot. You're gaining on There were going to be a fire. Achoo. Excuse me. Saved eight seconds. Granted, you can't really say much there, anyways. Good morning, but yeah. 007. We located the cell phone that the echelon system found and tracked it to the opening of an ancient catacomb beneath this construction site. We lost the signal when it went below ground, but you may be able to pick it up again once you get into the <coughs> Q branch and transmission. This construction site marks the point we lost Tedworth's signal. We need to find out if he's still friendly or working with our enemies. Use your smartphone to search for evidence. I forgot you have to do that first. We've cloned that computer's hard drive. I'll pass it on to our analysts. Continue searching the area. The foreman is ready to meet you. Please wait for him in the far cabin. Come this way. This way, Dr. Bond. That cutscene was longer. Lol. L O L. The intruder has been dealt with. Cut this move. Take care of the body. Copy. Just getting started with the other one now. We will cut out it. Generator and area two is down. Someone check it out. All right, fine. I was gonna try to vault, but I couldn't. And don't even ask there, I have no idea what happened. Did everybody just give up? Did everybody just give up? Like, they didn't even try to kill me. <laughs> what happened? They didn't even try. That makes no sense. This game doesn't make any sense. But whatever, let's move on. Cack Wade is right. Tanner, I'm headed for the catacombs. Hey, give me a hand over here. What? What do you want? I have a habit of in this game holding down the analog stick to sprint because sometimes just clicking it doesn't work. We've secured the perimeter around the But I I'm getting better at it, I guess. There's an intruder right there in front of us holding a gun. Oh, you know, it would help if I go this way. Okay. I'm fine with that. Do 
You are hurt. Get into cover. No thanks. Just barely made that. Turn around. Wait, what the? Okay. I don't. I, that was very disorienting. Tana, I'm in the catacombs. See I have to wait until he hangs up the phone to reload. Thank you, game. Got it. Bring up your phone, and it will give you Tedworth's position. Should lead you right to him. <clears throat> Haven't seen that takedown at all tonight. I've seen it, but not tonight. <laughs> It's so tempting to go right there all the time. Even though that's wrong. <laughs> I'm not gonna tell him anything. About that. Now move! Hey everybody. Please don't fall down like a moron this time. It's B to go up. It's B. Am I gonna get it? They didn't take my input the first time at all, so... Weird. I don't really associate modern-ish games dropping inputs. That's kind of new. Alright, how many shots is it going to take to kill this? Okay. It's fine, go. be a ladder somewhere. Where am I? I don't know where I'm going. Uh, okay. Probably did. Is it just him? Well, I'm still gonna save time if I don't die. 
this will still be a time save as long as I don't die. Okay, I don't have any ammo for that. That's okay. That's not good. Please take him down when I click take down. Get a weapon that has ammo. Okay, let's go. I'd rather just play it safe. Alright, we're good to go. Alright, last time I died like three times, so I still improved. Hold on, I'm doing the search. Here it is. Burn in. Low level gangster, a middleman. If he's got Ted Worth's research, he probably won't be holding onto it for long. Oh, what's up, Marveler? Hey Ryuzaki. How's it going, guys? What is the password for the USB drive? Tell me the key to crack the code. Stop! Stop! I'll tell you. Thank you. All right. Let's see how many times I failed this. On to MI6. Ted was dead. Burning on the move. You have him on satellite. Confirm 007. We're tracking him. Let us know if you lose visual contact. Will do. Stupid taxi. Wow. Wow. It, like, won't even let me turn around. Thank you, game. I'm gonna fail it. Yep. Thank you, game. The DB5. Holy crap, can we like... Dude, this freaking driving... Okay, maybe this one is worse than the ice one. Maybe looking at the car will help me here. Maybe seeing the car will help. Oh, no wonder I can't drive this. Because I live in the US, not... Istanbul. <laughs> The name of the car is the Aston Martin DB5. Gotcha. I figured that's what it was. Alright, time for a U-turn in this game for some reason. Probably find a first person again. I'm convinced that it doesn't. I don't, I'm convinced that this doesn't even lose time or anything like that. I'm convinced that both of them are the exact same. There's no way. Like. I'm not going the wrong way, game.
left the dock area, Tanner. Can you see where he's going? He's heading east, 007. Due east. Got through that fine. Not that I was worried. On pace to save a few minutes on this split. Bond, can you hear me? Come in, double Let me get some focus aims. Do I have... Okay, now I do. <laughs> yeah. I haven't seen Skyfall, but I have it. I have a DVD of it. I have yet to watch it, though. Take him out. Give us time. No. Oh boy. We're fine. I didn't pick up any ammo. Oh god, oh god. Uh, I was supposed to go in there, hang on. Wrong, playing it safe. I okay. I I don't know what happened. I got disoriented there. <sighs> Second death. I can still save a few minutes. That's what's crazy. This can still be a few minutes faster than last time. Yeah, that was right. There we go. Gonna go to bed, no worries, Ariel. Thanks for chilling. Have a good night. Please take him out, dude. Oh my god. I'm getting so frustrated with stuff when that happens. So freaking stupid, dude. I would have progressed, but I took so much damage there that I'm dead anyway. Great. <sighs> so close yet so far. Come on. 
Please take cover. Finally out of there. Man, I could have saved more time, but whatever. I could have saved another two minutes, maybe. No, the researcher is dead. But I've got the name of the buyer. Go on. Pomerol. That's why he's alive. True. You can. T James can take a hundred bullets to the chest. He'll still find a way to live somehow. I watched Casino Royale. I did not see Quantum of Souls. But yes, I saw Casino Royale. I'm not a gigantic James Bond fan, but I've seen some of the movies. Let me just take him out. Hurry. Alright. Time James. for the one speedrun trick in the whole game. Woo! What should I do if he doesn't show up? That's that's the skip. It skips the rest of that phone conversation. Cause we don't care. <laughs> Please cl oh my god, dude, this stupid game. <laughs> What's up, Krabby, Mud Crab? You're yeah, you misinterpreted. Type in exclamation point forty and you can see what I'm doing. Or somebody else can, if anybody's lurking. Well, I guess if you're lurking, you probably don't want to chat. I would do it, but I'm busy. Thank you, Arcadia. What I'm doing, I can give you a summary of it. What I'm doing is I'm picking a game that released in every year for the past 40 years. And I'm learning to speedrun them. And for 2010, I chose Bloodstone, because I had yet to speedrun this. Each one has only a small piece of it. 
I'm marking their locations on your smartphone now. Scan their access cards to compile the full code and access the lift. <laughs> Two guys just died. Is someone there? One down, 007. Yeah, Dr. No was the first. That's correct. Most recent one was No Time to Die, which I did see that one. I actually really enjoyed No Time to Die. Uh, wait a minute. Yeah, this way. This one's a little bit confusing, but we got it. We're fine. That's it, 007. You've got all the data necessary to access Pomerov's lift. Uh, that is... Oh, that's on the other side, so I have to run this way anyway. Spectre. I have yet to watch Spectre. I think the worst one I've seen personally is, um... <sighs> what was the last Brosnan one? Was it Die Another Day? That... Diamonds Are Forever. Yeah, I, I saw that one, or at least I tried to watch it, didn't really like it. No, not Moonraker. Um... I think it was Die Another Day. It was the last one Pierce Brosnan did, and I could clearly tell because that movie was so bad. Wait, why am I- what the heck? You won't be able to hack that door, 007. Why are you- why did I go left? You'll have to find another way in. I don't know why I ran to the left. You have to do this first. <laughs> I got ahead of myself. We're gonna do that, but I got ahead of myself. Yeah, Die Another Day. I hated that one. I gave up halfway through. I'm like, this is so stupid. <laughs> I've seen maybe half of the Bond films. I haven't seen them all. I have them all on DVD, but I haven't watched them all. Diamonds are forever. Yeah, I, I watched that one, and I... Yeah, you know, there's kind of a reason Sean Connery had left and didn't want to be Bond anymore. That's, that's, that's kind of the point. Yeah, yeah, that one, yeah. With the ice palace and everything. You're right, yeah. The one where the freaking The villain has, like... Those, uh, like, that... Those, like, crystals in his face. That one. Also, I'm probably dead here. I'm absolutely dead here. Somehow I'm not. Okay. And outside, what happened? They closed the casino. Get to the car. Bring it around to the front. Probably not gonna save time on this split, but that's fine. It's not a big deal. This this is a split, I can't really save much time anyways. I'll be amazed if I survive this. Yeah, I am. Uh, whatever. That's fine. Am I saving time? Wow, I did. Shocking. I think my favorite Bond movie that I've seen is... 
probably either... I don't know, man. There's a few that I thought were really good. At least from what I've seen. I have only seen about half of them, but I really liked Goldeneye. I liked Goldfinger. I would even, I even liked Casino Royale. I liked that one. Yes. Sorry to interrupt, 007. We hacked into Pomerov's mainframe at the refinery and found Tedworth's research, but we were shut out before we could read it. You'll need to get to the server room and access it through the Golden I was the first Bond movie I watched cuz cuz the video games. Can so, you send yeah. me directions? Yeah. I'm marking the location on your phone now. I did see No Time to Die and I actually really liked that one. I know some people, I mean, it's interesting cuz like some people liked it, some people didn't. At least that's just what I've heard. But I personally liked it. The Spy Who Loved Me, Casino Royale's number two. Gotcha. Yeah, I I thought Casino Royale was really good, actually. Nope, come on. I messed up. And yeah, least favorite, Die Another Day. Um, or some other duds I watched. Or at least the, what I thought were duds. Yeah. Yeah, that's fair. I... It's interesting. Like... I actually thought, um... The one with Denise Richards. Was that, um... Was that The World Is Not Enough? Was that the one she was in? Or was that a different one that I can't remember? The world was not enough, I didn't really like. But I actually... I didn't really like The World Is Not Enough that much, honestly. Like, there were some parts that I thought were fine, but then, like, overall, I'm just like, eh, like... Wasn't really crazy. I think I remember watching it, and I was like, the beginning of this is good, but then the but then it kind of st starts to fall apart. But, biggest surprise for me, one I didn't think I was gonna like, but I did, was, uh... Tomorrow Never Dies. You may be able to get through Surprisingly, I liked that one. And a voice that was a surprise for me. I didn't think I was going to like that one, and for some reason I was like, I like it. <laughs> uh, go upstairs first. I know what I have to do here, but I just never remember the order of what to do. Bet I can't punch these people. Tomorrow never does. Yeah. I was surprised to like that one. He drives it off of the parking garage. I think. I think it's that one. That's Pomeroff's voice sample. You should be able to access the computer center now. Marking location on your smartphone. Copy it. I'm on my way. Welcome, Mr. Pomeroff. Stay alert, man. Ah! Something cool. Yeah, I haven't seen all of them. I've seen about half of them. I saw... I've seen all of... Let me... No, it's fine. It's no, no worries. Um, but yeah, if you were talking about Tomorrow Never Dies, I saw that one. I've seen all of Pierce Brosnan's movies. I've, I think I saw all of Sean Connery's movies. I even saw On Her Majesty's Secret Service. I watched that one because that was the only one George Lazenby ever did. Um, thought it was fine. Like I didn't, I didn't love it, but I thought it was okay. That, that, for me, is, like, in the middle for me. On Her Majesty's Secret Service, I'm like, yeah, it's okay. Um, and then I, I've seen, um, seen a few of Roger Moore's. I don't remember which one specifically. Because you mentioned earlier how they all kind of blend together. It's like, yeah, around that point, that's where they all start to blend together for me. Roger Moore was your favorite Bond. I don't know who I would say my favorite one is. Lousy actor, but he can fight. Yeah. I just found it weird that he only did one Bond movie. Like, 
Did he not realize what he signed up for? Like... <laughs> To be fair, if he had done another, it, I don't think it would have been good. So maybe it's a good thing we only got one Bond movie out of out of him. Maybe that's a good thing. I don't know. And then I've saw I saw Casino Royale. I saw uh, No Time to Die, which is the most recent one. Which I I loved No Time to Die. I don't. I mean, I know some people. I know some people didn't like it, but I loved it. I thought it was great. For me, personally, it was one of the better Bond movies I've seen. Maybe it's recency bias, I don't know. But... Alright, we're gonna switch weapons, because... Why not? And then as far as Bond video games are concerned, I've played this game, GoldenEye N64, GoldenEye 007 Wii, GoldenEye Reloaded on 360, uh, 007 Nightfire I played. Um, is that it? I think that's it. I don't think I played anything else that's a Bond game. Double O Seven Racing PS One. Yeah, I've never played that one, but uh, so I, I can't vouch for it. But George Lazenby got bad advice from his agent. He wanted to grow his hair and beard as well. Oh. I see. Yeah, I, I also remember not liking Diamonds Are Forever. Um, what was the second Bond movie that Sean Connery did? Because I remember thinking that one was only okay. Because I watched, I watched the Sean Connery ones in order. Even Doctor No, I only think is okay. I wasn't th I wasn't crazy about that one, but I was like, it's a it's a fine movie. Like it's okay. I am so dead, probably. Nope, not. I did take my time there a little bit, but that's fine. <sighs> from Rush from Russia with love, yeah. I actually like that one more than Doctor No, but I still only thought it was like okay. It's been a few years. You don't remember? Gotcha. No worries. No worries. You're more of a Bond fan than I am. I haven't even seen all of them. <laughs> but from what I mean, even then, like, I've seen about half of them. And I still have my fill of these were amazing, these were bad, these were right in the middle. <laughs> I'm sure there's a tier, I'm sure there is a tier list online. Where you can make your own, or like you can make your own tier list of all the Bond movies, and once I once I see them all, that'll be easier to rank them. Cause I already know like what the, I mean the bottom one's gonna be Die Another Day. That one sucks. I'm if you like it, that's fine, but I don't. It's really, I did not like it. <laughs> um, and then like, yeah, number one would either be like Goldeneye, Goldfinger, or Casino Royale. It's gonna be one of those three. Or it's gonna be one I haven't watched yet. Access the central control panel, and I'll run a diagnostic. You need to watch it more than once to fully appreciate it. That's fair. That's fair. From the looks of things, it seems that if you override the Moonraker's the probably at the bottom. I can't remember if I watched Moonraker. I genuinely don't remember if I have. Find the override valve but that's I've heard that's a common opinion, is that Moonraker's like near the bottom for a lot of people. Yeah, you can put a link. That's fine. Links are okay. If as long as they're not like inappropriate or anything. I know you asked my mod, but that's okay. I can answer that as well. 007, the schematics show this route leads to the exhaust override. Lock the valve oh. and Yeah, they're not banned. If you post something yeah, okay. <laughs> if you do post something inappropriate, then you're gonna get banned, but by default, like you can you can post links. That's fine. That 
That's all right. I trust you. <laughs> I'm gonna pick that up because I feel like everybody's gonna have an MP5 coming up, and I'd rather have I'd rather have ammo, you know. Let's get one focus aim. Oh, I'm getting text messages from people, and I don't. Even, I'm not even at my phone at all. I'll look in a second, or at least I'll try to. Cer rank certain movie franchises. Gotcha. That would that would be fun. Some of them, granted, there's gonna be some I haven't seen, but the ones I have seen, those will be fun to rank. You've done it, Bond. Now head to the coolant station. And override the safety features. I might be in trouble. Oh, let me let me pay attention here. Okay, good. I reloaded in time. Take him out. I'm just gonna play it safe. I remember dying here last time. The Uncharted movie. Um, I did see Uncharted. I liked it more than I thought I would. That's my stance on it. I liked it more than I thought I would. And Marveler, I have the same opinion. It was solid. Or like, you say okay, but I say solid. It was a solid movie. There were obvious problems with it, but I liked it better than I thought I would. Absolutely. Make your way to the People station, bashed on the cast the casting system. choices, and I can understand that. I can. However, it's Tom Holland and Mark Wahlberg. Those two are great actors. Like, they really are. He wasn't bad. That was what was the most shocking. He wasn't bad. Again, it was... I enjoyed Uncharted more than I thought I would. Did those two guys notice me? Or did that just cancel? Okay, they didn't even notice. Weird. They do now, but... So what? Okay, I'm just making sure I'm going the right way. They... And that's what's crazy. They usually do. But, I again, I was shocked at how much I liked it. It is a, f like, if you're going in, like, first of all, if you're going in planning to, like, nitpick every little detail, you're not going to enjoy it. But if you just go in, just take it in, just enjoy it, just, you know, just take in the movie, just experience it, you're going to like it a lot more. But, yeah, it's, it, it is a solid movie. There's obvious problems that are going to be noticed. I'm not going to say them because I don't want to spoil it or anything. But, yes, there's going to be some issues with it, but... Again, I liked it more than I thought I would. But yes, the acting is very good in the movie, I would argue. I, I don't want to say any more on that just because I don't want to like spoil anything, but yeah, that's my stance on it. So yeah. Should have saw that instead of black light. I don't know what black light is, so <laughs> I can't. I can't really vouch for it one way or the other because I have no idea what that is. My mom sent me a text message That's earlier, but I'll respond well later. It's Activate not important. <laughs> oh, it's a Liam Neeson movie. Gotcha. I like Liam Neeson as well. I mean, I don't I haven't seen a ton of his movies or anything like that, but I like him. I don't get worried when I hear that he's casted for a part in any movie. I don't get worried. <laughs> Nicole, where are you? I'm on my way. I got held up. Alright, so I just have to wait this out. There's not really much to do here. Just wait it out. Don't die. Maybe respond to a text message if I have time. 
Screw it, hang on. I'm literally responding to a text while I am speedrunning. Welcome to 2022. Welcome to Bloodstone speedrunning. Wait, did I get either of them? I know I didn't... I, I don't know. I guess I'll find out. <laughs> Okay, at some points I'm boring at some points. I might have to Google it later and see what it is. Probably not gonna see it, but... <laughs> I'll at least research it so I can <laughs> get caught up, I guess, if you will. That's fine. You want to get on the same field as me, you just get a punch to the face. Okay, I've got the car. So yeah, again, you're just waiting this out. There's nothing you can do to make this fast or anything. Much like this entire game, there's not re this game is not really glitchy or anything. It's just... Gotta not die. That guy has a grenade launcher. He's not even dead. Yeah, I, I liked Nightfire as well. That's a fun one. Okay, I'm close. I mean, I think GoldenEye 007 is my favorite one. I didn't even grow up with that game. I played it way later in my... Like, I played it for the first time back in, like, 2015. Because that was the time I got a Nintendo 64. And I bought GoldenEye. And played it. And, yeah, it was... Super fun. That game's just fun. I'm I'm pretty young, so I, I I when I was so I was born in 1996. So uh, the Nintendo 64 came out the year I was born, but I didn't have one growing up. Funnily enough, I had a Nintendo, an NES, growing up. I had that. I had a Super Nintendo as well, but I mostly played the NES. That's how I have. That's how my video game uh, journey starts is with the NES. Most of my speed runs that I do are of NES games. That's not all I do, but that's most of what I have done is NES games. I'm gonna drive in third person here and see if this is any easier for me. I just drove underneath that part of the truck and I'm completely fine. Very cool. I just drove into that truck. Also very cool. James, the tower. Whoa, but, whoa, oh, oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, okay. Don't worry, everything's okay. <laughs> never mind, it's not. The t the t I forgot it's gonna blow up, so never mind. Almost a nice save. We got a checkpoint during all that, but uh, yeah. Or actually, did I, did we? No, we didn't. Never mind. We didn't get a checkpoint. That's a shame. I thought we hit a checkpoint. Oh well. I'm not too upset about that one. As long, I mean, if it happens again, then yes. But if not, then fine. It's, it's okay. Ugh. 
Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, Freaking jerk. Should still be fine. If the screen starts going black and white, that means that you're screwing up and you're probably gonna fail. If it's orange, that means there's a bunch of explosions. Much better there, much better. I didn't get caught up on some random rock or whatever. Not too shabby. What's 2011 gonna be? It's going to be Super Mario 3D Land for the 4040. I have already selected all of the games that are going to be done. They are actually li oh no, they're going to they're actually listed in the document that was under the 40 command. But yes, it's going to be Super Mario 3D Land for the Nintendo 3DS. That's going to be 2011. In fact, I've, I think I can tell you what games are left by memory. It's going to be Super Mario 3D Land, then New Super Mario Bros. 2, then Injustice, The Room, Splatoon, Typo Man, Arms, don't tell me, I'm trying to think here. It's after Arms. Oh, Unravel 2, Super Mario Maker 2, Clubhouse Games, and The Medium. And I will say that The Medium I chose... All these games were chosen before Metroid Dread came out, and before I ever played it. But, yeah, Metroid... If I had chosen now, Metroid Dread would have been 2021. And I could change it if I want, but nah, I'll stick with the medium. I'll just stick with it. I can do Metroid Dread some other time. None of those you've heard of except... Oh, wait! Okay, I actually could have backed out, but whatever. None of those you've heard of except Splatoon. Gotcha. No worries. That's kind of the cool part of some of these games, is that I had to... F there were some years, especially 2013, I played, um... Or I'm going to be playing Injustice, and I'm horrible at fighting games. I literally am terrible at them. But there's a category where you play on very easy and beat the story mode, and I'm like, I can do that, so... And 2013 was a hard year to find a game for. This... Played Death Stranding. I have Death Stranding. I have I have not beaten it. All right, I'm going back to first person view here. Let's see if this helps. This freaking driving section sucks. Let me pay attention here because I think that's part of the issue too. Is I'm not really fully focused on the driving. I can still make it go. Go, go! Wow! BRB, no worries. Oh my god, game. This freaking dr this driving is so bad. It's so freaking bad. Done now? Is that it? We've got to get off the ice. I think that's it. Yep. Not there we go. <laughs> Nicole. Nicole. Are you alright? I can't remember if there's one more section in this yeah. area or if I'm done. And we're moving on to the next one. No, there's this, and then that's it. I don't think I can save time on this split anymore after all those driving deaths. I don't think it's possible. Whatever. Not a big deal. Nice random headshot, by the way. Can I have another weapon, please? Thank you.
the Bourne movies are pretty good. Yeah, I've never seen either. I've never seen any of those. Nice job missing every single shot. <laughs> Identity Supremacy Ultimatum. Those are great. Some of your favorites. I always say I should watch more movies and try to see some movies, like some classics I've never seen before. But I never do. <laughs> I'm too busy playing video games. James, we're speeding up. Go. 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 Thank you. If I save time on this split, it's gonna be very small. It's not gonna be much. James, that's great. You've done it. Oh well. We're gaining on him. I'm heading back to the bridge. James, he's firing missiles. Oh boy. No, don't get stuck on the freaking stair, you jerk. Oh my god. Holy crap, dude. I did shoot I did shoot that guy in the PP. I shot him in his no-no square. Alright. This zoom is like barely any zoom. Two down or three down on that side? I can't even tell. You have a lot of health in this section, so I'm not really too worried right now. Okay, there's still one more on that side. That's fine. Here. Oh, wait, did I get it? Did I get it? I, I missed it. I did get it. Dude, I'm awesome. 1.5 zoom. Not even wrong. Stay on the right. Stay on the right. Don't go back. <laughs> Dude, I'm awesome. Okay, I've shot the engines. Can we be done now? Okay, by the way, I'm losing time on this split. 100%. We're almost done with this area, but I'm going to lose time, so. That sucks, but whatever. I'm not going to lose sleep over it. It's okay. If I didn't die 50 times or whatever on that awful driving section, I would have been fine. Please, reload! Yeah, that driving section is so bad. You had to make a driving section! That was so bad! No, not that guy! Shoot 
Oh, I saved six seconds. I saved six seconds. Okay, it was a time save, but so what? <laughs> I could have saved like minutes, dude. I could have saved actual literal minutes. And I saved six seconds. Whatever. I'm still 240 ahead. Good morning. I'm still ahead. So. Not a big deal. I can still save time in both Bangkok and Burma. Time save for next time, yeah. If I want. Where are you, Ping? We'll meet soon enough. But first, I need you to perform a small task in order to ensure our security. And what might that be? It's come to my attention there is recording equipment hidden in the aquarium. And we can't take the chance of anyone listening in on us. I haven't been to the aquarium in almost five years now. It was fun when I went though. I liked it. Yeah. I still have a video on my phone of when uh, my brother, sister, and I, we went to the aquarium. Just for fun. And, uh... My sister loves penguins. And we saw some penguins swimming around, and I got, them, I got it on video. That's the same one every time. Yellow, blue, red, and you're done. It's done. We're clear. Good. Meet me on the ground floor by. Out of my way, civilian. Yeah, I know. I didn't pick up whatever weapon he had. Great. There we go. Yeah, I'm just, I didn't do this right. I should have taken out that very first guy I saw. Because he's kind of... Yeah. I mean, not, as, not only is he still alive, but... I would have had a focus aim that I don't have. I mean, I have two of them now, but I would have still had more at this point. <sighs> Run, please. I don't care that you're tired. Run. Okay. Whatever, dude. Whatever, man. <laughs> Shoutouts to Joe underscore. <laughs> Joe Plate. <laughs> I think when I finish this run, I'm going to stop streaming for the night. Yes, it amuses me too. I mean, I know it's an inside joke, but still, like, it's so funny. Well, I guess, I guess all I'm doing is just running after this guy. I can, I can explain it for those who don't get it. Um, one of my friends named Joe underscore online. Uh... He made a room tour video back in 2015 after I made one. My old one is uh, gone. Like, it's it's outdated anyways, but you can't even find it online anymore. Um, and uh, he, one of the things he showed off in his room, he was, he was like, here's a plate of food I ate. <laughs> and that just kind of became a joke.
It's like showing off your room and it's like, oh, here's a plate of food I ate. It's still great. Yeah, it's still on his YouTube. It's still up there. It's still up there. Get this. Nope. Didn't get the little ladder skip thingy there. I got it last time, but I didn't get it this time. Uh, hold on. I just completely neglected to take that guy out. Come on. There we go. What's crazy is that this driving section in the PB I did first try. Stop. Take one more step and you're dead. Throw down the gun. No, just by talking to you. Just by talking to you, Alex gonna lose time in his speed run. Speaking of civilians running in the street today. I was trying to make a right turn, and all of a sudden two civilians came sprinting across the road. I, of course I waited for them to run across, but I'm like, what the hell dude, like why? Like there was literally a button there for you to hit that to signal that you want to walk across, and you decided to just try to run for it. Like I don't understand. So yeah. Long story short, people are stupid. Yes. <laughs> also, when I was at the retro game store this morning, um, I, some dude there smelled terrible. Like, actually terrible. Oh, I made a mistake. That might that might cost me. I I'm confused. I got I'm confused. But yeah, there was some dude at the store. I don't know why, but he he I well, here's the thing. He was with I'm assuming his wife or girlfriend, whoever. And they had a baby. And I at first I thought, oh, maybe the baby, like, you know, pooped the diaper or something. Like, whatever, that's what babies do. Um, no, he didn't work there. Um, but, uh, like, he literally, he reeked of cigarette smoke and something else that I couldn't pinpoint. And what baffles me is he has a wife and a baby. I was just like, I was just sitting there thinking to myself, I'm like, is she aware? <laughs> I mean, if I mean if it doesn't bug her, okay, whatever, that's fine. But I'm like, dude, like normally I don't care too much if somebody like smells bad or whatever. Like, I don't know, but dude, the guy reeked. Then again, I hate the smell of cigarettes and stuff. I will, I'll never smoke. Like, I hate the smell of it. So I don't want to be inhaling that. <laughs> it just, it's, ugh. 
I mean, granted, I, I I know a lot of people don't like the smell of cigarettes, so. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, that's it was like it was like that plus a combination of like maybe I don't know sweat even like I don't know just bo like I have no idea, but uh, I mean at first I thought the baby pooped a diaper and at that point I'm like okay whatever like they just need to change the baby's diaper it's not a big deal like whatever that's what babies do. But yeah, that is a bad combo. I'm just like dude like I I almost couldn't even. Like, it's, it's weird, because, like, normally I wouldn't even be in the same aisle. I'd be like, okay, I'm just gonna have to walk out. Or, like, I'm gonna have to go to a different aisle. But, like, I stood there to try to figure out who was smelling that bad. Yeah. Yeah, and that's the thing. I know people sweat, too, and everything. But it's like, if you shower every day, brush your teeth, you know, that kind of thing. Then most of the time you're not really gonna have an issue even if you're like sweaty and everything like that like as long as you wear deodorant and stuff like that you're fine not only do you smell better not only are, are people not gonna be disturbed by you but also you tend to feel better when you've cleaned up at least I do I feel better after like cleaning up especially if I was dirty and I get cleaned up I feel better after that I don't like getting sweaty and everything and then not doing anything about it. You never wear deodorant. I guess as long as you're not sweaty or anything like that and as long as you don't smell bad, I guess I don't really care. That's... <laughs> I guess it's all good. You're only 135 pounds and don't sweat much. That, yeah. You could probably get away with it then. Holy crap, dude, what is happening? How did I end up there? How f dude, this run is like falling apart. This is a, this is just, this run's falling apart. I know I have time to save in Burma, but it's, yeah, the, it's the driving, dude. The driving is so freaking bad. I was reading chat and did a 360. Like, I was, but, like, I was going straight, or 180, you mean. Like, I was going straight, I thought. And I guess I flipped around completely, and I was, like, I guess I was driving the wrong way trying to fix it. I don't know. This game, why isn't this game better? Like, this game had so much potential, and it's just, it, they wasted all of it. Like, come on. Welcome back, Marveler. I don't have another driving section until the very end, but the last one in the game is one of the easier ones, so I'm not concerned about that one. I got spun around even though I made the right turn, yeah. Welcome to Bloodstone. I don't even know if this is the worst James Bond game, but it's definitely the most mediocre and the most... Yeah, just mediocre. Get that body. <sighs> There's still no yeah. sign of the second driver. Go check the buildings along the riverbank and see if anyone. That's, that's just so disappointing. That is so disappointing. Bond, we've located a potential lead to rack from an old friend of yours called Silk. He owns a club not far from you. I'm marking the location on your smartphone now. Good. We'll be well paid if we find this guy. Is someone there? Over here. Should be fine. Yeah, we're fine. Sixtieth anniversary of James Bond on film. You're right, actually. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Sixty years. That's crazy. Yep. 
1962 was Dr. No. Ten five sixty two. Is that October fifth or is that May tenth? <laughs> October fifth, gotcha. That's what I thought, but some people do it back- or for me it's backwards, but for them it's correct, so... Come on, go! Holy cow, man. This freaking game. To be fair, I did just play this entire game once already, and now I'm doing a second attempt. So, probably explains my insanity. Global James Bond Day is October 5th. Well, there you go. Alright, that was slow, but we got through it, so I don't really care that much. I should not have wasted a focus aim there. Should've just did a takedown. How is he not dead? Oh, a shot to the balls is what kills him. Okay. Good game. I know I'm gonna lose time, so I don't care about wasting a little bit here to do that. I am gonna do that just in case. I don't think I needed one, but just in case. Ideally, if I was two minutes ahead, I'd still be happy. Come on, stop running into th the camera's locked there, so you can't see where you're running. <sighs> I could have saved two minutes. Instead, I lost 12 seconds. But I'm still ahead, so. Take that. Not gonna need it, but I'll take it. I can save time on this split though. Like basically every split except for the first, third, and last was a time save. Now I've got a giant frickin' tank trying to- OH GOD! Oh, it was one more building, I just blanked out for a second. That's all it takes, one second and you're dead. You stop- you stop thinking for a second. 
It was one more building and then you make a turn. Then you turn left. Yeah, that was... Just silly on my part. Whatever, it's fine. Can still save time even with one death. That's all good. Just need to play well the rest of the way. By the way, if anybody's curious, the world record in this game is 1 hour, 30 minutes, and 34 seconds for console. But for the PC version, it's 1 hour, 22 minutes. <clears throat> and most of that time on PC is saved through loads. That's why they split the leaderboards from console and PC. I'm playing on... Can't really see it. Xbox 360. I don't know if it's faster than the PS3. I would assume it is just because 360 games you can install to your hard drive, whereas PS3, not really. Even then, PS3 loads are slower. Yeah. Alright, take him out and go. And go. Thank you. Ow, dude, how am I dead? If you outrun him, you should make it. Why am I dead? Come on, man. This section is so stupid. This is one of the worst sections in the game. Am I dead? No, I'm not. Okay. At least, at least that uh, one death is fine. That's better than like the five I had last time. But still, like, that's there's no reason for that death to have been a thing. How am I alive? Literally how? This freaking game. If you want an insanity test, play this game. Okay. We're getting there. I will take that. Here we go. Textbook. Sort of. We'll just chill here for a bit. I was trying to freaking switch weapons! Dude, come on! <sighs> so fr- Okay, I didn't mean to vault over that. Though, I wonder if indirectly that's actually better to do. Hey, can you pick this up? Thank you. Almost there. Just... Got it. Okay. Well, that was a freaking waste of time.
The saddest part is I think I'm actually saving time so far on this split. Unless if the rest of this goes horribly wrong. And yes, it can do that. This is not over until it's over. <clears throat> We're not going to need this grenade launcher anymore. It's actually not going to be that useful. So I'm going to try to grab something else. There we go. Yeah, punch him in the face and the balls and he's just dead. Even though he's wearing frickin' a hundred layers of armor. Welcome to Bloodstone. This is your captain speaking. I'm dead. Or not? I am now. Thanks, game. I hit a checkpoint, which is good, um, but that's it. There must be another guy in that corner I never see, because I always get shot there. Take cover. Wait for this to descend a little bit, and then grab it. And do that. Welp is right. <sighs> that is as true as you can get, is Welp. Oh, come on. Dude, I'm literally, I literally can't even get anywhere, man. He gets hung up on every little thing. This is not the James Bond I know. That was, that was a mistake. I was supposed to wait a little bit before doing that. Or at least my strategies. Punch them in the face once, they're dead. Shoot them with ten bullets. They're still walking. To be fair, that is a problem Call of Duty has, too, where you shoot somebody a hundred times or whatever. But, uh, if you throw a throwing knife at their foot, their heart stops. Yeah, I, I can. I actually can save time on this split. The last split, maybe I can save like a second or two, but the last split doesn't matter too much as long as I don't fail. How many more must die because of your ego? I like how Rack thinks I'm the one with the ego. I want to get focusing. That way I can waste it on that guy. And waste one on that guy. Waste one there. Uh. 
I do like that you can chain uh, your takedowns together. Granted, you know. You have to wait on the elevator to descend anyway, so I'm going to destroy that uh, explosive because an enemy is absolutely going to shoot it if I don't do that. And then I'll just uh, try to take out a few enemies if possible. I said if possible. Oh boy. Oh, I didn't know the. Oh, hang on. There's somebody behind me too. Where? There you are. I'm. Wow. Okay, we're alive, but I didn't realize that there was a guy still there. Also, I'm totally dead. Yep, because if there's a freaking sniper up there who I've never seen, literally never. Freaking game, dude. I cannot catch a break. I need to hit the switch again. I didn't hit it. Might as well just camp. Might as well, right? Oh, no, it, it, it is coming down. Okay, never mind. Sorry. Like, I don't understand how there's a freaking sniper here now who I've never seen in my life. Whatever. I don't freaking care. <laughs> As Frame Perfection once said, my sanity is gone forever. And there's another frickin' sniper, dude! I got him, but... Holy crap, man. Always something with this game. No matter what, it's always something. He's just... Can, I, can all these enemies stop for like five seconds? I feel like I'm losing my mind. To be fair, I've been playing this for almost four hours. I didn't think about this when I decided to try another attempt. Nice! That guy just- I just clipped that guy through the box or whatever. Whatever. Let's just- let's just try to finish at least. This is a terrible run, just like the first, but... Whatever, let's finish. If this was real life, James would be dead at this point. He would have died at the beginning of the game. I wish I had a combat rifle, actually. I just shot the guy's hat off. I wonder if he likes that hat.
Why? Oh, this sucks, by the way. Oh, I got ammo. Cool. Please take him out when I press X. Alright. What's funny is I can still save time on this stupid split. I'm still on pace to save time. was like really stiff there. All right. Don't make the same mistake as last time. Take cover, dude. Get in freaking cover, man. Holy lord. Yeah, I'm gonna save time. Great, I have to reload during this freaking stupid thing. Alright. Alright. Well. Last, uh, last level. That time save could have been bigger, but whatever. It is time save. It is time save. Or as we used to say, Simtave. I don't remember who typoed that, but it's funny. Yeah. It's like, I could have saved so much more, but at least I'm saving some? Granted, there's not a whole lot of time to save in this game anyways, because this game, you basically just play vanilla and skip the cutscenes and stuff. But, uh, yeah. Whatever. I'm not, I'm not too upset. I mean, maybe frustrated a little bit, but I'm not really upset or anything. It's... I'll still sleep tonight. I am I uh, let's just not talk about it. I just want I just want to finish at this point. <laughs> like let me get a free three and a half minute PB and then I'm done. <laughs> Arcadia, they should pick Joseph as the next James Bond. <laughs> you stupid cop cars! St I'm gonna fail. Wow! There goes 30 seconds. Just like that. A seventh of my time save is gone already. Actually, I think it's more than that. Am is the whole run dead? Is the run just dead now? 
Are we, are we really, yeah, driving with the left foot. Is the whole run just dead? Because if so, that's fine. Go ahead and just kill it. This game is so bad. <laughs> There's a reason this game was forgotten about. I'm trying to turn! Granted, that was better that time, but still, I wasted time. I'm gonna lose a whole minute on this stage, probably. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot, game. At least I didn't spin around. That's fine. Take out the driving sections in this game. This game goes from mediocre to... Still mediocre, but at least it's enjoyable. I don't know why they put a driving section at the very end of the game. I don't know why. It's li literally the last thing you're doing is driving. And your dri the driving's not even good anyways. Like... <laughs> so weird. Is it at least going to sub 150? I don't even think it will. Which is a shame. Because I had the potential. It's fine. Drive on that side. Kill that civilian. I don't care. This is going to be close if it'll sub 150. It's going to be close. Let's just finish, because I'm done looking at this game. Did I hit her on that one? I just missed it. Just missed it. No one cares about that cutscene. James Bond will return in 007 Legends. A game that's probably worse than this.